What's stopping you from showing up fully for your work every day? What's keep making you resistant to the task or the project that's in front of you? Is it because you feel like you don't know enough? You don't have the right training or the, the right skill? Well, I have seen so many people make a lot of progress in their business and some people who feel stuck and all of us feel stuck at one point or another. And I, my belief is that there is a common, common, deep reason why people don't show up fully in their work. And it's because of fear. It's the fear of making a mistake, fear of looking bad to other people or to yourself, the fear of not getting a good result, essentially. And how does, why, is the, why is the fear there? The fear is there because of a mistaken perspective that the result matters a lot. And if you believe that the result matters a lot, oh, if I don't, if this doesn't go right, then uh, I will be poor. I will be out on the streets. I mean, whatever story you start spinning around in your mind. Oh, if this doesn't go well, I will be embarrassed. If you believe that the result matters a lot, then you will invest a lot of your energy in being attached to that outcome. And that attachment to the outcome is what creates fear in the moment. Fear that may even prevent you from getting started. So allow me to give you an alternative perspective that you can replace with attachment to the outcome and fear of doing the work, which is that there is a higher meaning in every moment of work that far surpasses whether the result does well or not. There is a higher meaning to every moment of work. Now, what, what is that higher meaning? Well, it depends on what your life philosophy is. So I want to ask you, how would you answer the question, what is the higher meaning or the deeper meaning to each moment of work? Now, I'm not saying that there is a different meaning to every moment of work. I'm saying that there's a higher meaning. Now, yes, the higher meaning could be different for each moment. But what, what might be a common thread for the higher meaning of each moment of work? So let me share with you what mine is, and I'd love to hear what yours is. So I believe that somehow that you and I are deeply cared for by a higher power and that the path that you and I are taking is towards ultimate bliss, is towards complete understanding of life and the universe, is towards the greatest experience of love. That's the path that we're taking in life and after this life. And that path of soul growth towards, you might say, God, you might say ultimate source of love and wisdom, that path that you and I are taking, it is an inevitable path, meaning neither of us can screw that up you, it's impossible for you to mess up the fact that you are on that growth path and that every single moment in your day is an opportunity to grow. Every moment, if you are to be willing to open yourself up to that fact that there is a growth moment right here, right now, and there's many, there are many ways to grow. It's not that you're going to necessarily learn some idea or tip in every moment. That's called you know, mental growth, you might want to say. But even just being open to an experience and going through that experience, even if it's painful, even if it's hard or confusing, just being open and going through that experience, you will come out on the other end saying, wow, I went through that experience. I'm still here. And somehow you're going to be stronger because the next time you go through that experience, it, you'll have some familiarity and you probably will have some uh, ability to do something different that you couldn't have done before. So there is a growth opportunity at every moment and that your growth path is inevitably towards ultimate bliss, love, 
wisdom, power, creativity, and all good things. So if that's true, if that's true, and I believe it is, then I also believe that every moment of work is not about the result. It's not about whether this thing goes well, whether this project launches well, whether this person responds well, whether I look good or bad, or whether I get it right or wrong. It's not about that. Every moment is about, am I open to the moment? Am I learning something, whether it's mental learning or just soul learning? And the answer is, if I'm open to it, then I'm absolutely learning something. If I stay present to it, I am absolutely growing. And so if that's true, let, let's let go of whether something happens well or not. Whatever email we're writing, whatever web page we're creating, whatever product we're making, whatever bookkeeping we're doing, I don't care what kind of work we're doing in the moment. Let's not be hyper-focused on, on, on the result. Let's let go of that and therefore let go of any fear of what happens afterwards. And let, let's be here, open to the experience, knowing that there is possibility of growth and therefore there's possibility of joy in every moment, knowing that we are taken care of, that the results will be taken care of. So I hope this is encouraging for you. I hope that you will go forward today with a little bit more openness to every moment, seeing what kind of growth there is, and knowing that at the deepest level, there is joy there. I am George Cow, Authentic Business Coach. I love talking about this kind of stuff. And I wish you a wonderful rest of your day.